Well, back in the country now, the long-awaited signing of the One Kenya Alliance Coalition Agreement has been thrown into disarray after NARC Kenya pulled out at the last minute. The flower party that is led by Martha Karua is seeking more time to study the draft proposal that has been formulated by the Coalition Technical Committee. The coalition brings together principals Kalonzo Musioka of Waipa Party, Senator Gideon Moy of Kanu, Martha Karua of NARC and Cyrus Girongo of the UDP Party. The move comes barely a day after Kalonzo Musioka said that he was ready to work with former Prime Minister Rilo Dinga, but on new conditions. The decision to postpone the signing of the coalition agreement was arrived at by the Party National Executive Council after a two-day meeting in Naivasha. 36 hours, the party received the final text of the draft coalition agreement and related documents from the OCA technical team. We are immensely grateful to members of the technical team for their service not just to OCA but to the country at large. Number two, that upon receipt of the draft OCA coalition agreement and consistent with the resolution 5-2 of the NAC Kenya Party's National Delegates Convention of 18th um, February 2022, the party immediately mobilized the National Executive Committee to a special NEC meeting to deliberate on the documents as presented and to consider the same for approval. Number three, that the party is aware of emerging multiple legal interpretations of the Political Parties Act as amended in 2022, especially with regard to the formation and management of coalitions and coalition political parties. Number four, that the party appreciates in equal weight the pressing timelines for critical decision making and the need to move both expeditiously and in accordance with the law. That the National Executive Committee therefore resolved as follows. That the NEC needs more time to familiarize and scrutinize the coalition agreement and related documentation. Number two, that the party's legal team is instructed to seek clarity on any and existing gray areas, prepare and present a detailed brief to the National Executive Committee. And finally, that NEC shall meet within the next seven days for final approval of the document. Still on politics, just like in previous elections,